News in a nutshell. In the news today is news. Multi-millionaire media maven Ariana's Huffington Post is now a cool $315 million richer. Fabulous, darling. This journalista's jackpot is all thanks to the advent of aggregation. Or, look, here's some stuff I found on the web. Why pay for journalists to work when the work of journalists can pay you? If only they would have thought of this sooner. Ernie Pyle here, reporting from my study where I just discovered some neat links on the war and did a bang-up job of search engine optimization. And I just snapped some Jim Dandy screenshots of this AP photo collection of war-torn Europe. Extra, extra! Give us your work for free and we'll make millions! Blog all about it! Agrigopolis was a success, as aggregation was the new key to big bucks. Merger upon merger and links upon links until new aggregators began to aggregate aggregators. Website A used content from site B in exchange for B getting eyeballs from A. Soon B realized it could do the same thing and gathered from site C, but C was no dummy, and soon A through Z all did the same thing. As aggregation abounded, links were linked, and exposure exposed. Until one day, little Tommy was at school researching a report on journalism and democracy. Tommy turned to the web, clicked, and found... An aggregate of links, linking to nothing but aggregators' links of each other's aggregated links. Good night, little Tommy, and good link.